welcome to my new TV show. Andre asks. Each week, I ask lots of people lots of questions. Let's start. Hi, what's your favorite food? It's spaghetti. Really? Why is it your favorite? Because it's delicious. Hello. What's your favorite video game? It's Road Runner. Oh yeah? Why? Because it's fun and exciting. Hi. What's your favorite animal? My favorite animal is a rabbit. A rabbit? Why? Because rabbits are so cute. Hello. What's your least favorite sport? Hmm. Baseball. Baseball? Really? Why? Because it's so boring. Hi. What's your favorite book? It's Barry Hotter. He's a wizard. Really? Why do you like it? Because it's really interesting. Hi. What's your least favorite subject at school? That's an easy question. Math. Oh yes. Why is that? Because it's so difficult. Hi there. What's your least favorite movie? It's Ghost Fighter. Oh really? Why don't you like it? Because it's really silly. Hello. What's your favorite TV show? It's Hammer Henry. Okay. Why? Because it's funny. Hi. Who's your favorite singer? Mary Mary. Why do you like her? Because she's so cool. Hello. What's your least favorite food? It's broccoli. <laughs> All right. Why is that? Because it tastes and smells horrible. Yuck. <laughs> How about you? What are your favorite and least favorite things? And why? <laughs> Hello. I'm Ben. I'm a wizard, and I go to wizard school. I have a magic wand. I like doing spells to help people. Look, poor Lucy can't reach the candies on the top shelf. Let's help her. Zap! Good. Now she is much taller. John is late for his bus to school. He's not fast enough to catch it. Zap! Now he's much faster. Mary and Kate are playing on a seesaw. Oh dear, Mary isn't heavy enough. Zap! Now she's heavier. Helen and Harry want to play tennis, but the weather isn't very good. Zap! Now the weather is better. Peter is hungry, but he only has a little biscuit for lunch. Poor Peter! Zap! Now this biscuit is much bigger. Susie wants to go to her friend's birthday party, but her dress isn't very beautiful. Zap! Now it is much more beautiful. Ken wants to wear his old baseball cap, but now it is too small for him. Zap! Now his head is much smaller, so it fits. Blair is going too fast downhill. She can't stop. Zap! Okay, now she is going much slower. 
Sarah's picture is nice, but she doesn't have many paints. It isn't very colorful. Great! Now it's much more colorful. Colin's belt is too long. Now it's much shorter. Look! Lisa has baked a cake. Oh dear, she's cooked it for too long. It is black. What a bad cake. Let's help her. Zap. Oh no, sometimes my wand makes mistakes. Now the cake is worse. I should go home now before I get into any more trouble. Hello, my name is Bob. I'm a bus driver. Here is my bus. Let's go for a drive. Look at the wheels go round and round. Oh no, it's raining. The wipers go swish, swish. Look out, be careful. The horn goes beep, beep. Let's stop and pick up some passengers. The doors open and shut. It's so noisy. The babies go boo hoo hoo. Please sit down. Phew. What a busy day. It's time to go home. Good night. Hello. I'm Liana Ladybug. I'm going to hide. Where am I? Can you find me? I'm under the chair. Where am I? Can you find me? I'm on the bookcase. Where am I? Can you find me? I'm behind the door. Where am I? Can you find me? I'm under the table. Where am I? Can you find me? I'm by the window. That was a fun game. Goodbye. Who's this? It's a little strawberry. Hello, strawberry. One day, the strawberry tried to lift a jug of cream. He pushed and he heaved. But it was too heavy. Along came an apple. Hello, apple, said the strawberry. Can you help me to lift this jug, please? They pushed and they heaved. But it was too heavy. Along came a banana. Hello, banana, said the strawberry. Can you help us to lift this jug, please? They pushed and they heaved. But it was too heavy. Along came an orange. Hello, orange, said the strawberry. Can you help us to lift this jug, please? They pushed and they heaved. But it was too heavy. 
Along came a bunch of grapes. Hello, grapes, said the strawberry. Can you help us to lift this jug, please? They pushed and they heaved, but it was too heavy. Along came a melon. Hello, melon, said the strawberry. Can you help us to lift this jug, please? They pushed and they heaved, but it was too heavy. Along came a pineapple. Hello, pineapple, said the strawberry. Can you help us to lift this jug, please? They pushed and they heaved, but it was too heavy. Along came a lemon. Hello, lemon, said the strawberry. Can you help us to lift this jug, please? They pushed and they heaved, and finally they could lift the jug. Pour the cream into that bowl, please, said the strawberry. Everyone poured the cream into the bowl. Jump in! shouted the strawberry. Everyone jumped into the bowl and had a wonderful time swimming in the cream. This is Susan and her dog, Benny. One night, Susan took Benny out for a walk. Ah! Ooh! Suddenly, a ghost appeared. Later, Eek! a monster jumped out. Then, Cackle, cackle. A witch walked out. <laughs> After that, Oh no! Meow. A big black cat arrived. <laughs> Next, oh, oh, oh. Gulp! A wizard came along. Soon after, a mummy walked over. Then, sob, sob, eek, eek. A big bat flew over. Afterwards, a zombie appeared. Happy Halloween! Don't worry. They are just kids wearing costumes. When it's sunny, I am happy. When it's rainy, I am sad. When it's lunchtime, I am hungry. When it's noisy, I am angry. When it's stormy, I am scared. When it's bedtime, I am sleepy. Hello, I am a rabbit. I can jump. Hello, I am a dog. I can run. Hello, I am a kangaroo. I can hop. Hello, I am a dinosaur. I can stomp. Hello, I am a cat. 
I can turn around. Hello, I am a bird. I can fly. Hello, I am a dolphin. I can swim. Hello, I am Tom. I can ride a bicycle. Jamie is going to school. He is carrying his magic school bag. What's in your bag, Jamie? I have pencils and pens and books and glue and crayons and rulers and erasers and scissors and a pencil case and a stapler and pencil sharpeners and tape and a sandwich and juice and even a computer. What a lot of stuff in your bag, Jamie. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mickey. I love measuring things with my tape measure. Let's measure some things together. Okay, how tall are you? And how tall do you think a giraffe is? Let's see. An average giraffe is about 600 centimeters tall. Next up, how long is your hair? How long do you think a horse's hair is? Let's measure. Some horses can grow their hair, called a mane, up to 570 centimeters. Amazing! So, how long are your arms? The gibbon has extremely long arms. How long do you think they are? Well, I'll measure and check. Look how long his arm is! 180 centimeters! How long is your nose? An elephant has a very long nose, called a trunk. How long do you think it is? Let's check and see. About 200 centimeters long. How long is your hand? Gorillas have huge hands. How long do you think a gorilla's hand is? Let's find out. Wow! about 27 centimeters long. How long are your legs? An ostrich is a bird with very long legs. How long do you think they are? Let's see. About 140 centimeters long. They can run very fast, up to 70 kilometers per hour. How long are your feet? A polar bear has enormous feet, called paws. How long do you think they are? Let's measure and find out. Its paws are about 36 centimeters long. Last question. How long is your tongue? 
The blue whale has the longest tongue of all. How long do you think it is? I'll dive down into the ocean and measure it. Look at that! It's about 580 centimeters long. And it weighs as much as a car. Wow! It's time to wake up! Good morning, monsters! Every day, after I get up, I wash my face. After washing my face, I brush my hair. Next, I get dressed. Today, I'm wearing a t-shirt and short pants. Then I eat my breakfast. I always have cereal and milk. After breakfast, I brush my teeth. It's fun to brush my teeth. Finally, I put on my shoes. Oh no! I can only find two shoes. I need six. Now we are ready. It's time to go to school. Goodbye. Good morning, monsters. I wash my face. I brush my hair. I get dressed. I eat my breakfast. I brush my teeth. I put on my shoes. Now we are ready. It's time to go to school. Goodbye. It is the last day of school. Tomorrow, the summer vacation starts and all of the monster kids are looking forward to a long vacation. The teacher, Ms. Zarkov, asks what everyone's plans are for the vacation. Halsey, what are you going to do during the summer vacation? Asks Ms. Zarkov. I'm going to play tennis every day. I joined a tennis club and I have six tennis rackets. I'm going to play in some competitions. How about you, Kaza? What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I think I'm going to learn to fly. My wings are strong now, and my mother said I am ready. Well, that's fantastic, replied Miss Zarkov. Where do you want to fly to? I think at first I'm going to fly around my neighborhood, but after that I'm going to fly to the tops of the highest mountains and have picnics there. And how about you, Basher? What are you going to do? Asked Miss Zarkov. I'm going to smash and bash things, replied Basher. Oh, Basher, exclaimed Miss Zarkov. Why don't you do something different this summer? Basher thought hard. I'm going to jump on things and smash and bash them. I love it. Oh well, sighed Miss Zarkov. Misha, what are you going to do? I'm going to swim to the bottom of the ocean with my family and visit my starfish cousins. We do that every year. That sounds nice, said Miss Zarkov. What are you going to do with your cousins? 
We are going to go to a wedding. My oldest cousin is going to marry an octopus, answered Misha. That's lovely, remarked Ms. Sarkov. What about you, Dozy? asked Ms. Sarkov. What are you going to do? I don't know, replied Dozy. Oh, you must have some plans, said Ms. Sarkov. No, not really. I'm just going to sleep a lot. Okay. Are you going to go anywhere? Tried Ms. Zarkov. Oh, yes. I'm going to go to the shopping mall with my mother, Dozy remembered. Great. What are you going to buy there? Asked Ms. Zarkov. A new bed. I can't wait to sleep in it, exclaimed Dozy. Mishmash, what are you going to do? Asked Ms. Zarkov. I'm going to eat and eat and eat, replied Mishmash gleefully. But you do that every day, exclaimed Ms. Zarkov. Is that your only plan? Yes, replied Mishmash. I'm going to eat trees and road signs and chimneys and bicycles. Oh no! Said a shocked Miss Zarkov. That doesn't sound healthy. I know, but my father won't let me eat cars. He says I'm too young. Said Mishmash sadly. Then Misha put her hand up. Miss Zarkov, she said. What are you going to do during the summer vacation? Oh, thank you for asking, Misha," replied Miss Zarkov. "Let's see. Well, just the same as I always do during the summer vacation. I'm going to scare kids, fright monsters, and eat people." Cool! Shouted everyone in the class. My father is good at playing sports with me. My father is good at driving. My father is good at painting. My father is good at telling jokes. <laughs> My father is good at fixing things. My father is good at cooking. My father is good at swimming. My father is good at making things. My father is good at reading stories. My father is good at playing video games. Hello, my name is Ziggy. Welcome to my planet, Zorg. Let's meet my friends. This is Zappy. He is always happy. <laughs> Look, these aliens are called zillions. They are always hungry. This is my sister, Zally. She is always noisy. These are my brothers. Zing, Zang, and Zong. We are always quiet and sleepy. Sometimes I fly in my flying saucer. I am very fast. How about you? Which of these are true about you? 
You are happy. You are quiet. You are noisy. You are fast. You are sleepy. You are hungry. It was fun talking to you. Now I am sleepy. Good night.